J.C. Kelsey and Fletcher Cox both announcing their retirement recently. J.C. with a very emotional press conference. Fletcher with a beautiful letter. We've got Kyle Schwarber and Bryce Harper coming out to catch the ceremonial first pitch. I hope they don't cross it up. Kelsey let it fly yeah, a little bit. Yeah, nice sink to it, too. It sure did. That may be a nice collectible item at some point. Would, would you have ever thought to do that? Bryce just did Fletcher. He just did Fletcher's dad's. Oh, that was cool. That's a cool moment for the fans here in Philadelphia. The same for uh, for Jason and Fletcher. Aaron Nola on the mound. He makes his 236th career start as a member of the Phillies. He's going to make a lot more than that as he signed a seven-year deal last November to remain with the club through 2030. Ronald Acuna Jr. is in the batter's box, and so we're just about ready to go. Acuna on a couple of bounces. Boom, boots it. Yesterday, C.J. and I discussed a couple of years ago how he really struggled over there defensively, and he was unable to come up with that one. And probably putting a little pressure on himself with his high chopper, knowing how well Ronald Acuna Jr. runs. He tried to barehand it. Likely not necessary to do that. So an error on the third baseman, Bohm. And just like yesterday, Ronald Acuna reaches quickly. And now Ozzie Albies. And he hits this well to right center. Castellanos back. That baby's gone. Ozzie Albies, two batters in, makes it two to nothing Atlanta. And he's got the Braves' first home run of 2024. Riley was 0 for 4 yesterday with a walk and a run scored. Off the end of the bat, popped up outside of first. Harper is over, and oh man, look out. Holy cow. He didn't know where the railing was. He flipped over onto the camera well. And Joe Roush gets to him right away. Looks like he's okay. There's so much you worry about. Head, shoulder, yeah. everything. Yeah. Fingers as he's looking at his finger. That might have cut his finger, but man, thank goodness he popped up and he's okay. Kyle Schwarber leads things off here in the bottom of the first against Max Fried. Off the hands into left center field, a base hit for Kyle. So Schwarber's aboard to begin the bottom of the first. Here's Trey Turner. Wow, beautiful. Just painted the inside corner at 97, and down goes Trey Turner. Well, Harper, again, yeah, just uh, flipped over the railing. See how he fares here. Outside. Ball four. That'll put two on for JT. There go the runners. Pitch taken for a strike. Throw to third, and Schwarber is safe at third. Safe and secure. Harper follows behind him. Fleet of foot. Kyle Schwarber, no stolen bases last year. Numero uno this year. Well, he's tied with Ronald Acuna. It's the two leadoff hitters and stolen bases here. He walked it. And the bases are loaded with one down for Alec Bohm. Swung on it, a little flare. Out past first base, coming back. Olsen, and he's had a bit of squeeze it somehow. Now it's a little bloop down the right field line, and he goes back and makes an over-the-shoulder catch for the out. And all the runners stay put. What a great play right there. And now to be up to Castellanos. Also good numbers against Freed. Four for eight with a homer. 2-2 two -two with two men out. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Where is that? What in the world? This wasn't even close. Oh my goodness. That is every bit of strike and look like nearly down the middle, maybe slightly elevated, but that's in the zone. Castellanos was walking to the dugout. Ball four. That'll force in a run. What a break for the Phils. Third walk of the inning. It's a 2-1 ball game. Bryson Stott is the batter. The bases are loaded. Swung on, line towards left. Kelnick coming on. He won't get it. It's a base hit. One run will score. JT coming around third. He will score. It's a two-run single for Bryson Stott. And the Phillies take the lead. It's 3-2 here in the bottom of the first. And that is it for Max Fried. He throws 43 pitches here in the bottom of the first inning, and he doesn't make it out of the inning. So Harris will reach to start the second inning. And you hear the boos for the shortstop Orlando Arcia. This one down the left field line. That's trouble. Merrifield's going to have to track it down at the wall. Harris stops at third. And Orlando Arcia, a couple of doubles yesterday. Another one here in the second inning, and the Braves are in business. Now the bat in the hands of Travis Darno, and he has an opportunity to at least tie up the ball game right here, maybe even give the Braves the lead again. Darno reaching for it, and it stays fair. Just inside the chalk, a two RBI double for Travis Darno, and Atlanta has the lead right back at the top of the second. And yeah, the Braves have made lots of contact versus Nolan. That one came in on the hands and broke the bat of Kelnick, but it still found the outfield grass. He's got his first RBI as an Atlanta Brave as Jared Kelnick, and it's five to three. Matt Olson up to the plate. He leads off versus Nola. That ball is hit high to right field. 
Castellanos back. Will the park hold it? It will not. It is gone. A moonshot off the bat of Matt Olson. Last year's home run leader in Major League Baseball has his first of 2024. Boy, he roped that. Only question is it extra bases. He's headed for second. And he will get in there standing. A double for Michael Harris. A great start to the season for the Braves center fielder. And Orlando hits one to Turner. But he's not going to be able to make the play. Great effort just to keep it on the infield and keep Harris at second base. Darno hit a two RBI double his last time up to right field. He sends it to right field again, but no problem for Castellanos. Talked about his throwing arm. It's cut off as Harris gets up 90 feet to third base. So now Kelnick, he had an RBI single last inning. He's got a chance to do the same here. Runners at the corners, two outs. Kelnick, another RBI single. Atlanta attacks on 7 to 3. 7 to 3 ball game. Braves lead it. Bryce Harper bats for the second time. We go to the home half of the third inning. To left center. Kelnick, diving attempt, and he got it. Wow. Two RBIs with his bat and a spectacular play with his glove. Here's JT Realmuto. Swing and a drive. Left field deep. Kelnick back. Track. Wall. It's gone. And JT Ramuto with his first hit of the season. It's a solo home run to straightaway left field. And the Phillies get one back. It's 7 to 4. Kelnick, and then back to the top of the order here in the sixth. How about Kelnick? He just keeps hitting. This time the other way, he finds the gap between Turner and Bone. Acuna lines it to center field. So back to back hits to start the sixth inning. The trouble on the base pass. Acuna at first, Kelnick at second, and Albies up to the plate. Ozzy reaches for it and finds the outfield grass. RBI single for Albies. Atlanta, eight runs on 16 hits. And now Marcelo Zuna, the batter. He's 0 for 3, looking for his first hit of the series. Maybe it'll be a big one. Ozuna in the air, left center. Merrifield back. Goodbye. The Big Bear with a big fly. It scores three, and it's 11 to 4 Atlanta. Double and a single and a walk for Michael so far today. This ball is hit high, and it is hit deep to right. Through the raindrops and out of here. Michael Harris, a double, a singer, and a single, and now a solo homer. And Atlanta is up 12 to 4. And another sky-high home run right on time making some of the issues for Brogdon when it came to left-handed hitters. So Michael Harris joins the free hit parade for the Braves. With one more out, Braves will set themselves up to go for a sweep tomorrow. And that'll do it. The Atlanta Braves have already clinched the series win against Philadelphia. They will go for the sweep tomorrow.